Hello, my name is Autumn Wiles, and these are your daily announcements. Urgent reminder that this week at all three lunches, seniors can have their free yearbook picture taken on the south lawn facing the Performing Arts Center. Seniors can park at the PAC and walk to the photographer's station and then depart. This, this event is for seniors only, but if it's successful, we hope to take pictures of the rest of the student body at a later date. Don't let COVID take away picture day. Have your picture taken for the 2021 yearbook. The Ponca City Bowling Association is forming high school bowling teams to compete against other high schools throughout the state of Oklahoma. All students enrolled in Ponca City High Schools are invited to join this free program, bowling against over 115 high schools in Oklahoma. Come join the fun. Practice times are Tuesday and Thursday at Ponca Bowl in Ponca City. Practice sessions begin at 4 p.m. or whenever the team members arrive and last until approximately 5 p.m. Tryouts and team selections will start October 20th and competition will begin in December 2020 and last until mid-February 2021. And now for sports. Hello, my name is Brady Ladner and this is your weekend sports recap. Oklahoma State had a bye week this week and were supposed to take on the Baylor Bears, but due to COVID, the game was postponed until December 12th. The Oklahoma Sooners took on the Texas Longhorns in the Red River rivalry. Both teams were coming off disappointing losses and both needing hope to stay in the race for the conference championship. The Sooners took an early lead of 10 to nothing in the first quarter before Sam Ellinger and the Longhorns came storming back in the second quarter. At halftime, it was a tie ball game at 17-17. Spencer Rattler came back into the game after first quarter benching and he led the Sooners to another lead of 31 to 17. Ellinger again stormed right right back before the end of regulation, tying the game to send it into overtime. The teams battled back and forth until Sam Ellinger was picked off in the fourth overtime to steal the game for the Sooners. Their record improves to 2-2, two two, while the Longhorns also drop to 2-2. Two two. Both teams have a week of rest next Saturday. The Dallas Cowboys faced off against the New York Giants, and both needed to win to stay in the race for the NFC East. The game was very close, and in the third quarter, the Dallas quarterback, Dak Prescott, broke his ankle and will be out for the season. The Cowboys won the game 37-34 to improve to 2-3 and, and take lead of the NFC East. They will take on the 3-2 and two Cardinals next Sunday. That's all for sports. Back to you in the studio. That's all we have for today. Have a great day and go Cats.